idea began when I was eight months pregnant, and I was very interested in the idea of something being created inside of my own body, and um, my position as a kind of participant, but also a kind of a viewer of this creative process, and it was around then that I began to think of the idea, and then at eight months pregnant, I um, put myself in this reclining nude position and uh, had my body scanned, the surface of my body. And that then eventually was um, digitally altered to carve out the belly. Um, and then it was increased in size only to a scale that was large enough for an adult to crawl into the center of the womb. And um, like all my work, the piece is so much about the violation of the viewer artwork boundary, giving viewers a prompt that they can't resist in engaging physically with the artwork. A lot of my work comes out of this almost this sort of sadness or hurt feelings growing up. So I was always in the art world. I was my family collected art. And the lack of ability to participate, to even have an opinion, let alone physically engage with it, was this kind of general source of hurt feelings for a very, very long time. My work is a kind of antidote to that. Um, to that source of hurt feelings by giving the viewer the opportunity to have this kind of very intimate, very engaged interaction. No. I mean, I arrived at this moment as an artist where I was pregnant, and it's sort of um, obviously not always the case, but it's often the case that it's an occasion for female artists to choose to focus their creative energy elsewhere. And many female artists don't, but it's certainly a moment where you ask yourself, if I want to not remain engaged, no one would blame me for not remaining engaged. And I had the opposite response at that moment. I was interested in taking what was being created inside of me and channeling all of those feelings and all of that energy into uh, the creative act in making art derived from that moment and in kind of capturing that moment as a kind of permanent, durable, ephemeral moment. I mean, I think that there's an initial reaction that's just the pure joy of transgressing that viewer artwork boundary before you're even climbing inside the body, you're stepping onto the pedestal, which is already this kind of joyous transgression. And then being inside, when you're actually in there, there's a little cocoon of noise and um, you feel like you're in this special place and you're very aware of having become a part of the artwork and then people photograph you, you become a kind of permanent part of the his history of the work. And I think for a lot of viewers that's sort of, um, I don't know, it's a kind of a thrill, you know what I mean? So um, yeah, I love that. I mean, for me, the moment where I see somebody crawl inside and feel being in there is just like a tremendously satisfying moment.